literally get my camera out, but yeah. Uh, there's that pink banks. construction it's for also Nintendo. Where they film movies like Psycho, starring Anthony Perkins, that iconic shower that scene that. Really down there a the pen that they use the surface, uh, all 13 use the asphalt around the sound stage for the surface of the building. The lights are on, on the town. On your right, you see some construction going on for Halloween Horror Nights. Alright, we got some fans. Come back starting the day after Labor Day, you can get the bejeebus scared out of you. This is rumored to be killed. There's some man. green in there. On your right, you're going to see some more sound stages. Them. Now, we got our broadcast TV debut with the opening. Yes, make sure you remain seated, folks. Hold on to your stuff and supervise your kids. Because we're going to take you back into Skull Island. But before we do that, let's hear a bit more from Peter Jackson. company that focuses on CGI and computer generated imaging. They use some of the most advanced filmmaking technology in the world as well as some of the world's largest screens. 40 feet tall and 180 feet long. Now what a digital has six Academy Awards, six Oscars, so they're very good at what they do. And they worked on a lot of different things and even if you haven't heard their name you've seen their work, like most recently in The Batman, starring Robert Pattinson. Giant tanks 
at the top of the hill that releases the water. Remember here, I'll put you a footage what happened back in 2015 there. A certain monster. Flashback. Frankenstein was in the into an area ready to be felt on all of the decoration is exactly where it needs to go. Now we can use the decoration as context clues to figure out where we have just been transported to. Clearly, we're at a subway station. Which subway station and which point? Oh, welcome to San Francisco, everybody. Quick four hour drive up north. Uh, any second now, these doors should open and hopefully the tour can keep going. Uh-oh. Uh um, hey, hello, we're in here. Can you turn the effects off, please? Hello? Okay. This, oh, no. We got time, everybody.
here's the cycle house. We have construction for the tear trim. Not a whole lot for the last video. Here's a nighttime shot. It's kind of hard to see even here. I wonder if Norman Bates will be out right now. Back! That was so cool! They were, the leads were sitting on the limousine! Oh my gosh! That's amazing! Welcome to the War of the World set. It's one of the larger set pieces we've got out here. Uh, a lot of things you've seen tonight. To well, I gotta cut that off because... Universal has been fortunate to work with generation-defining directors like Alfred Hitchcock and Steven Spielberg. And now we are thrilled to partner with Academy Award winner Jordan Peele. We are taking you through Jupiter's Claim, the actual sets from his new sci-fi thriller, Nope, no. which stars Daniel Kaluuya, Kiki Palmer, and Steven Yeun. Welcome to Jupiter's Claim. In Nope, Jupiter's Claim is a nostalgic small-time Southern California amusement park owned by former child star Ricky Duke Park. Over there, look into the winking well and have your picture taken, just like the kids in that old 90s movie, Kids Sheriff, the lights are... a movie within the movie. That's what this whole place is loosely based on. Anyway, behind this Hollywood fantasy of a gold rush frontier town lies a sinister secret. It is smack dab in the center of a UFO hotspot. What's a bad miracle? You're about to find out. Welcome to the world of no. Hello? Anyone home? Specific. I'm the man in charge. I need to watch that movie to so understand. George. It's about to get real interesting. So, a 
remember, remain seated, hold on to your personal belongings, supervise your kids, and do not want shot to find us or the witness and the two friends. Keep you safe. Awesome. I haven't played Jimmy Fallon in a while. Wait. 